Welcome to a proof that the derivative of cosecant x with respect to x equals negative cosecant x times cotangent x. To begin, we'll use a reciprocal identity and rewrite cosecant x as one over sine x, and then we'll find the derivative of one over sine x with respect to x using the quotient rule. So when applying the quotient rule, we have the denominator, which is sine x, times the derivative of the numerator, which should be the derivative of one, and then minus the numerator, which is one, times the derivative of the denominator, which is the derivative of sine x, divided by the denominator squared, which is sine x squared. Next, we'll find the derivatives. The derivative of one with respect to x is equal to zero, and the derivative of sine x is equal to cosine x. And notice how we also can rewrite the denominator, which is sine x squared, as sine squared x. And now we'll simplify the numerator. Sine x times zero is zero, and then we have negative one times cosine x, which gives us a numerator of negative cosine x. So now we have the derivative is equal to negative cosine x divided by sine squared x. And now we're gonna write this fraction as a product of two fractions. We'll write the first fraction as negative one over sine x, and then times the second fraction, which would be cosine x over sine x. Notice how we still have a negative fraction, and we have a factor of cosine x in the numerator, and two factors of sine x in the denominator. And since one over sine x is equal to cosecant x, and cosine x divided by sine x equals cotangent x, we have our derivative. The derivative of cosecant x is equal to negative cosecant x times cotangent x.